What's up? This is Ace and I'm back. That's right. Your stand-up comic slash adult film performer, porn star, whatever you want to call it. I'm back. And today, as I promised, I want to answer a few questions that was left in the comments. First question I want to answer. Uh, somebody asked if I had ever had beef with anybody in the industry. You know what I'm saying? And since I had beef with them, was it anybody I wouldn't work with? And was that beef ever resolved? First of all, beef in porn? <laughs> now that sounds funny to me. You know what I'm saying? Like if two dudes got beef, you know, you come to the set and you like, yo, yo, what's up, what's up? No, you know, what's up? I hear you saying that you packing more than me. No, what's up? I got 10 and a half, what you working with? Trust me, in the porn industry, when you dealing like with as many women as we dealing with and you know, getting it in like we get it in, you don't really have time for beef. You know what I'm saying? So uh, no, I never had no beef. I don't beef anyway, you know, I'm in my 40s, man. I'm too old for that. Second question, somebody asked if I had ever been a victim of friendly fire. In other words, like, you know, doing a scene, got a bunch of dudes, one chick or whatever, has the dude ever popped off and anything got on me? No, 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 no. One thing you always make sure of, when you on set with a bunch of dudes, and uh, you know, it's one chick, and her face is the target, and a dude's about to pop off, you know what I'm saying? You start seeing him shaking, making noise, eyes kind of rolling in the back of his head. <laughs> If you in the way, if you standing across from him <laughs> and right by her face and he's about to pop off, you know, uh, yeah, uh, uh, you, you get out of the way. <laughs> you make sure you like, no matter what you doing, I mean, she could be working you too, but once you see that, you like, like whoa. <laughs> you doing all kind of stuff to get out of the way. No, fortunately, I've never been the victim of a uh, friendly fire. Next question. Somebody asked, and this was a good one, um, if I think I'll ever get married, and if so, could I ever marry a porn star? Um, now let me just say, as far as me getting married, I don't know. Cause let me just say this, before I even started porn, I wasn't a marrying type. You know what I'm saying? And ladies, I'm sorry to admit it, I cheated on all my girlfriends. I know, I know, I know. So um, I was never the marrying type. I never really thought about it. I always liked being with a bunch of women, um, but that's a whole different story. But if I ever do get married, would I marry a porn star? Yes. Uh, she's probably gonna have to be a stripper, porn star, somebody in the industry or related to the industry. Because women that are not in the industry, man, they say they can deal with the fact that I did porn, but um, it always comes down to them looking at one of my videos or something going, did you like that? Does she taste better than me? Uh, you look like you're really enjoying yourself. Why you never put one leg up for me? Yeah, so if I ever get married, yeah, I could very well marry somebody that, uh, somebody from the industry, you know what I'm saying? But I gotta get a lot more out of my system first, you know what I'm saying? So I'm single for now and I'm loving it. All right, so the next question. Um, what is the worst thing that a woman has ever done to me on set? What's the worst thing? Um, I guess that would have to be, took a dump on me. Literally, yeah, I mean, took uh, out the back door, dump on me. <laughs> now, not on purpose, I've talked about this before, but a lot of chicks, when it comes to anal, you know, they think they can really do it, they're not supposed to eat for 24 hours before the scene, but some of them stop off and get a burger anyway, get the big combo, come to the set, like, ooh, I'm ready. Next thing you know, I'm up in there, you're getting up in there, and especially in that, um, if she's sitting on top of you, you know what I'm saying, and it's anal, you're doing her. And uh, I guess the first time I was like, mm, mm, mm. And you know, they always want you to lift her a little, so they can see the guy's win, you know. Kept doing that. One time I was like, mm, mm, mm. And it was like, boom. And I was like, okay. 
that is Carl Jr. Number three, right here on me right now. This is, ugh, that's about the worst thing ever. And you know the worst thing about that, I think is the fact that I got used to it. Like after the second time, it didn't even really bother me no more. You know what I'm saying? Like after the second time it happened, I just was like, oh, 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 that's nasty. Hold on y'all, let me uh, take about 10 minutes and I would just go get in the shower, boom, right back on set. Mm, mm. <laughs> that's what's really scary. <laughs> but anyway, that's it for the day. Like I said, I'm answering more questions. So go ahead, leave your questions in the comments. Leave your comments in the comments. Uh, check me out on Twitter. And please go ahead, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead, do so. And when you're not busy, just go through all my videos because a lot of questions are answered on a lot of the videos I got on the channel. Anyway, I want to thank y'all for watching. I'm Ace, and I'm out.